Well, hello, family and friends. It's the Hala Hala Hikers. We are back again for another hike, and it is approaching Valentine's Day, so we decided that we should do a semi romantic hike and try and find the mysterious, the hidden, the unknown heart rock that's supposed to be in Joshua Tree. But if you've ever been to Joshua Tree, you know there's so many rocks. It is going to be difficult to find. So come along with us and let's find that heart rock. As some of you might know, Joshua Tree National Park is a massive 1200 square mile desert and it's full of some amazing geological formations. Apparently some of these rocks are almost 2 billion years old. So somewhere on social media I happened to see this picture of a woman standing near a heart shaped rock and it instantly became an easter egg I had to hunt. One difficult thing is there are rocks everywhere. Joshua Tree is full of rocks and boulders and my goodness it's going to be hard to find this heart rock. Let's name some of these rocks. We're looking for a heart. A heart rock, okay? We're looking for a heart rock, but what does this one look like behind us? Look like a turtle head? Yeah, a turtle head. Should we, could, should we name it the turtle head rock? The turtle head rock. Yeah, that's a good name for that one. What about this big rock over here? What's that one? What does that look like? A lion. It kind of looks like a lion. We'll call that one lion rock. Let's keep looking for the heart rock. The heart rock? Yeah, let's go find it. What do you want to name that one? So, take called the lava monster. The lava monster. Someone's been watching Moana. I think I'm going to name this one Suzanne Summers. She looks like she works out. She looks like a, a whale or something reaching the ocean. We call that Willy. It's free Willy. <laughs> The Brontosaurus rock? It does look like a big dinosaur, huh? The Brontosaurus rock, ladies and gentlemen. Call this one R2D2. Call this one C3PO. Call this one BB8. Call this one the Mandalorian. <laughs> There's rocks everywhere. We can't find the heart rock. Where is this? Where is this heart rock? Where is it? The rock that we're looking for isn't on any marked trail, so it makes it difficult for bloggers or YouTubers to give step-by-step -step directions there. I've read about people actually camping for several days and never finding it. I think the people that have found it don't want to tell other people because it makes it a little more special that way. <laughs> I saw it from a distance. But after we went through this little valley, I lost it for a second and now we came back up on the other side and I'm kind of disoriented so this is hard to find. But we're going to keep looking. I already see it, but I want I want him to be the one. What'd you find? It's a heart rock. Did you find it? Yeah. Go get it. It's a big one. What'd you find? A heart rock. A heart rock. Cool. You should go tell Mama Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, Mama. Jumping from cliffs so high, trusting our wings to fly. Sometimes we're crashing down, but we get up and start from the ground. Searching for my high 
highs. Not only did he find the heart rock, but this is also the, pretty much the first time that he's hiked the entire duration of the hike. So we still have to hike back to the truck, so we'll see if he lasts that long, but good job, buddy. It's a good family day and a good Valentine's hike. Um, it's a pretty cool adventure. Okay, thank you. I'll leave a link to the trail map below that is the closest trail to this rock, but I won't tell you exactly how to get here. You have to do a little research, and if you look hard enough, you might just find it. I hope you guys are having a great 2020 so far and have a wonderful Valentine's Day. I hope you guys are getting outside, staying hydrated, and don't forget to keep on moving.